Hi guys, Remag1R here, and today I'm going to be playing Sport Asphalt 9. In this video, we are going to be driving this car, the Koenigsegg CC850. Let's get straight into this. Alright, so, this is the CC850 S-Class 5145, I believe. I drove this car for the first time in the previous Asphalt 9 video, so you can check it out if you haven't. Um, so let's see how good this car is. I'm expecting it to be... And top speed oriented, just like all the other codex eggs. So let's see. Oh yeah, really, really short nitro efficiency, so yeah, that, that's a take mark for that. Handling is good, so there's a take for that. Top speed... I couldn't really tell exactly, but it seemed to get close to 300, so we'll, we can get to say uh, fast top speed is a check. And horrible acceleration is also a check. Yep, this is a your this is just your typical run thing. That was a weird finish. Okay. So yeah. We was, we, now that we've got that established, I just, I wanna see what how fast this car can actually go. So let's see if we can reach our top speed. We haven't reached it on the bridge. Because I'm pretty sure we go on the bridge at one point in this track, but I don't I don't know. Oh uh, wait, do we? No no wait. Wait, yes, no, I can't, I can't remember. I can't remember if we got on the bridge or not. Well, uh, this is a pretty straight section. Oh, I'm still accelerating, how? How fast can you go? How fast can you go? Oh, yes, there's a bridge, okay. Come on, go, go, go. Oh, look, he said I wish you were flying past him. There we go, bye. Oh, it's 300 plus. It looks like 312 for a second. I, I, I saw 312 for like a split second there. Like literally just a, a tiny little second. We hit 300. Oh, this guy's gonna be this though, I think. Oh yeah, second place. So 312 mass power is my guess at this car's top speed. Hopefully we get another pretty straight track. Okay, final race. Okay, yeah, this is not exactly the track I was hoping for, but should be fine. So yeah, this is just your typical cloning egg. Bad acceleration, bad natural efficiency, really good handling, really good top speed. In comparison to the other cloning eggs, um, I'd say this is like better than the Gamera, but oh, I'm, I'm dead. Okay, that's nice. As I was saying, I'd say this is probably better than the Gamera, but like worse. Then the Yesco, because the Yesco mu it goes much faster than this. And I feel like the Yesco has slightly better nitro efficiency. I mean, I can't tell for certain. But uh, it's, it's a hunch. I have a hunch that the Yesco is, nitro efficiency is better. But someone fact check, someone fact check me in the comments. So I am dead again. But this race is not going well. Ah, uh, it's sound glitch. There, that's nice. You gained that a lot lately. I'm not sure why. That's just the thing in this game now, I guess. Going over the final three corners. So I, I, I can't go. I can't go through there in time. Go 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 go! Fuck wave. Get some speed. Go. Come on. And cross the line. Fourth place. Not a terrible race. So yeah, twenty six CC eight fifty. Again, typical typical traits of a Koenig Seg. Um, we'll be able to get this from Drivers Syndicate Seven, um, which I feel like it's gonna be probably be, gonna probably be a bit hard to get considering Drive Syndicates are always like that. But if you do manage to get this thing, uh, please do let me know how it drives uh, in comparison to the other Koenig Segs, because I would like to know. Anyways, that's gonna be the end of this video. So thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, comment, all the YouTube stuff. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.